my channel and Meals with Jen. If you're new here, please like and subscribe so that way you're always updated with my new recipes and videos. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make my homemade street tacos and salsa. For that, you're going to need corn tortillas, carne picada meat, fajita seasoning, adobo all-purpose seasoning, chicken bouillon cube, tomatoes, onion, jalapenos, serrano peppers, garlic, lime wedges, and for garnishing, you're gonna want uh, cilantro and diced onions. So let's get started. Okay, so right now, you're gonna wanna start off with your salsa, and we're going to boil these uh, peppers, onions, and tomatoes, and garlic until it's um, soft, and then from there, we're going to transfer to our blender. Everybody in the pot. Okay, so just a little treat for Bay. This is his first time having mango with uh, chamoy and uh, tahini. So I'm really excited for him to try it. It's super delicious, and I hope if you've never tried it that you give this um, a try. So we're going to add our chamoy. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. And you can add more or less whatever you like. And our tahini. Now let's try. Okay, let's give this a try. She swears by it. So good on any kind of fruit, really. Is it in there? You mm -hmm. see it? Yeah. You know what it tastes like? It tastes like those suckers. Yeah. <laughs> um, it has tahini on there and chamoy. <laughs> oh my god. It tastes just like those suckers. It's good, right? So good. And then, it's so juicy. Yeah, the, man the, the mango is really, really good. It's got a good, spicy, sweet. Little tang. Oh, that's making me delicious. For these tacos, though. Mangoes. Juice. I've never felt so primal in my life. <laughs> all right, so my peppers and tomatoes, onion, garlic are all soft, ready to blend. Let's do it. All right, babe says it's gonna be good. Let's see how she did. Caution, maybe spicy. Who knows? We'll see. That's gonna be good. That's gonna be real good. Ooh, it's got a little kick though. If you don't like a whole lot of spice, this one might not be for you. Tone it back a little bit. Maybe one less serrano. Maybe no serranos and just jalapenos. Yeah, you could do that. Another tomato would do it. But we like spice, or I like spice, and I'm the one who's gonna eat this. You're gonna eat some, but you know. It's really good if you like spice. If you like spice and you like flavor, I'm double dipping, but it's just for us, so, you know, if you're feeding family, don't, don't double dip, obviously. But this baby is fire. Alright, so my pan is hot and I have oil in here. And I'm going to break our meat apart and cook that down. Alright, so now that I've added our meat to the pan, we're going to start seasoning. Uh, we're going to start with our fajitas. and our adobo all-purpose. 
give that a good mix and we'll see if we need to add any more. All right, so now we're going to grease our tortillas so they're nice and pliable and delicious to eat with our, for our tacos. Hello, Mr. Jalapeno. How are you doing? Ah, you are roasting, I see. All right, everything is done. Let's assemble our tacos. So that was a lot of meat that I made. If you're interested, see what I do with my leftover meat for tomorrow's video. It's gonna be really good. I have lots of ideas and I'm very good at improvising on anything that I make. I make sure nothing goes to waste. Either way, this is gonna be really good. So, you want to lay out your meat, and traditionally, onions, diced. Sometimes you will see grilled. Um, I love grilled onions. Sean prefers raw, so I'm making it for my baby. And then you're gonna add uh, cilantro on top. And then, look how beautiful he turned out. I can't wait to eat him. <laughs> and then we're going to add, if you like, Sean can do his own. I love my lime, so I'm gonna squeeze some on mine. All right. Go ahead and put some on mine. Oh, okay. And now it's the time you've all been waiting for. Let's taste. Yeet. All right, guys. The final touch before we taste. That salsa. Cannot forget the goodness. Let's do it. Okay. Well, let's do it. Are you are you having one of these? I said let's do it and that was the final. Oh, I thought she was taking away my taco. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, now it's time to taste your street taco. Let's do it, yeah? First, we start with Mr. Jalapeno to get the spice flowing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You're supposed to take a bite of your taco and then you bite it. Baby? Let me teach him. There Ready? he goes. Cheers. Mmm. Hey. What do you think? It's always me talking, you talk. If I wasn't already married, I'd marry myself. That is so good. I'm 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 a good cook. I'm sorry. Not trying to be cocky, but that is really delicious. And if you've never had street tacos, or if you want to learn how to make it, this is where it is. Make this. You know, you probably have a cooking channel because you're a good cook. And the best I know, I'm so lucky to have married a beautiful Hispanic woman who knows how to cook all sorts of things. 
put that jalapeno though. That's where it is. Don't skip on him. He brings you back to Mexico. If you've never been, he's bringing you there. It's delicious. I'm sorry. Hey. I don't know if I'm a mess, but. We got a lot of meat left over, and we're making a video tomorrow with the leftovers. So be sure to tune in. We know we left y'all alone for a little while. We gave y'all a little break from the awesomeness. We're gonna make a delicious meal tomorrow. Mm-hmm. Tune in.